Well, happy Saturday, everybody. Unfortunately, it looks like maybe it's another round of strong and severe thunderstorms across portions of the area. Start by taking a look at the overall severe weather outlook. The greatest threat of that will be across eastern areas like it usually is. And everyone say about Worland onto the east, especially across Johnson as well as Matrona counties. So you think of severe thunderstorms, three things, damaging winds, large hail, and tornadoes. Well, the least threat, I think, will be damaging wind today, about a 1 in 20 chance anywhere you see the uh, brown area within a 25-mile point. There will be some rotating thunderstorms possible today. That does mean we will have the possibility of seeing maybe a tornado in some areas. Greatest threat across uh, Natrona County, this includes Casper as well as southern Johnson County, especially along and east of Interstate 25. But anywhere in the green area, you could actually see a small chance of a tornado, but it's pretty small, about 1 in 50 within 25 miles. Greatest threat today, though, Looks like it's going to be large hail. You can see uh, anywhere the slight risk, it's about a 1 in 6 chance. Casper, Buffalo, out toward uh, Worland once again, out toward eastern Fremont County. Anywhere in the brown area, about a 1 in 20 chance there. So as we sum up the overall threat, greatest threat that's large hail, we're calling that medium, maybe low medium as you head further to the west. Low risk of damaging wind and a low chance of a tornado. Best chance of all these occurring, Johnson, Detroit, and Cowies, especially east of Interstate 25. So as we time things out, disturbance will be coming in from the southwest and spruiking northeast across the area. Places like Rock Springs will see the thunderstorms develop in the early afternoon hours and spraying north and east across the Bighorn Basin and Wind River Basin, finally reaching Casper and Buffalo later in the day, which means a higher chance of severe weather there since we'll have more sunshine, more time to destabilize the atmosphere. You can see our resources there for weather. If you want more detailed stuff, you want to geek out on the more technical stuff, go to the Storm Prediction uh, Center website, spc.noaa.gov. And you want to look at the webcam, see conditions for yourself, just go there and follow those directions. Have a great weekend.